Thanks for your question, Matthew. Um, I think there's probably more than three different strategies that will deploy uh, to enable us to succeed. Um, we're doing a big piece of work at the moment about pricing and price sensitivity. Uh, we're doing a big piece of work in the digital space, uh, but aspirationally, we have to reach a new audience, and that's the most important thing in determining success for us, but also rewarding the loyal, proud, and passionate fan base of Corably spectators. So lots of work probably more than three factors uh, and certainly an interesting journey for us ahead. I think that some of the venues we have selected uh, give us a great opportunity to tap into local communities and go beyond the core rugby league um, support. Uh, Newcastle, uh, 52,000, we want that to be a sellout to give the tournament some great momentum and some of the big cities like Sheffield and Liverpool, uh, games uh, in Manchester um, and also obviously our marquee property um, in London will enable us to um, reach a new audience. So uh, can't wait uh, to deliver the ticketing strategy and uh, look forward to uh, enticing a new audience to our magnificent event. We're working in partnership um, with the RFL. Um, Legacy to me is before, during and after and Legacy is much wider than just encouraging more people to play the game which would be a wonderful output. So this is about new spectators, it's about new brands uh, and it's also about operating and delivering uh, a sport in a new digital space. Uh, so we will be very collaborative and we uh, will take our responsibility tremendously seriously in terms of leaving a lasting impact. I think the selection of our venues uh, demonstrates our aspiration and our vision. Semi-final weekend, we have two um, incredible venues, um, one in London uh, and one in Leeds, um, on consecutive days. Uh, so we're under no illusions about how hard we are going to have to work um, to make sure those venues are full and vibrant and people come along and have a great time. Uh, we've started very early, uh, we've got some government funding um, in place, we've selected our venues uh, and now we're on the journey to uh, our strategy of um, customer acquisition and making sure that people come and have a really fantastic time. Uh, thanks Steve. Um, yeah, uh, great question, uh, not one single answer. Um, we're working across the piece to attract new spectators to the tournament. Uh, we have a really diverse legacy programme called Inspiration All and we look forward to delivering that in local communities uh, as part of an awareness campaign to excite, stimulate and get people to buy in uh, to the tournament. Mm -hmm.